the third video in our series of Array CGH for PGD. In this video, I am going to discuss labeling and precipitation. As a reminder, this step follows 1. Embryo biopsy 2. Whole genome amplification In this step, the whole genome amplified product is tagged with a fluorescent molecule by the action of the Cleno enzyme. Both the test and reference samples are labeled with different fluorophores such as cyanin-3 and cyanin-5. The incubation time for labeling can vary between 2 hours to overnight. The labeled products are then ethanol precipitated. An indication of successful labeling is a distinctive purple colored pellet, as you can see here. I'm going to get closer to the camera. The pellet will then be resuspended in preparation for hybridization. It is important to mention that labeling and further steps should be carried out in dim light, as most fluorophores are photosensitive. 